Hello everyone, welcome to Patient Safe Handling. These are the slings we use for the maxi move uh, to lift a total patient. Very important, make sure this is on the inside of the patient when you're transferring them and make sure that the stabilizer bars are also in place. There's two of them. Without these, it's gonna throw off the center of the patient. Um, also, to, if you're not sure what size to use, you have different sizes on the front of the machine uh, from extra small to extra large. You also have a guide on how to set the patient up and transfer. Um, very important thing too is to make sure that the battery is fully charged. On this machine you will see that the icon is fully charged. They should be charged every 12 hours and it takes 8 hours for a battery to fully charge. Also you have to make sure um, that the smiley face is facing the patient, the two eyes and the little smiley face is facing the patient and also that if you can if you don't have that on you can also tell what size to use on this side and when you are putting the patient onto here someone should be holding it, it should be two people make sure that the wheels are not locked because the machine steadies itself if your battery was to die or anything you have an emergency clip up here you pull this out the rod and you can lower the you know, manually by turning it, lower the patient, okay? Okay, patient is set up. As you can tell, most important thing is you never crisscross these because you can create shearing male or female body parts. So it's important to have it under each patient's leg and not, not to crisscross. Smiley face is towards the patient. You see the rabbit ears are up, she's ready to go. We're going to take the patient and we're going to move the patient from bed to chair. Put her in the same position. Comfortable? As you can tell, the stabilizer bars support the neck and the lower upper back. So once you have the patient over, you move the patient into place, lock it because now you're not lifting the patient. This is the point you can lock it and then you lower the patient. You have someone watching the head and everything else. Make sure that we don't squeeze any of the patients. Patients are never to hold this. And there you go, we have a successful transfer of a patient and did not need any lifting at all.